Right, so this is just a sort of like a little fun video that I'm filming because I'm a bit bored. Um, you may know if you've seen my pre previous videos, I've got this Astra van here, which has been a pain in the ass. Um, what happened was I had my key in the boot here and I opened it and it hit this bit of wood here and it snapped the key out of like the actual sort of fob part. So what I'm doing is I'm going to make my own custom key. Uh, <laughs> bit of fun. There's the old part. I tried taping it on but it did nothing. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut this off about here. Weld this part on there and then we're going to get the end of two other spanners and put them either side so it's sort of like a cross so I got something to hold to turn the key. It's just a bit of fun. Uh, whether it'll work out or not I don't know. If it doesn't I can just cut it off and probably either get like a replacement key or just work with it being taped in there. So yeah it's just a bit of fun. See if it works. If it works it'll definitely be cool. Um, and then I'll just have that on a hoop somehow. I'll drill a hole through this and put a hoop through it and connect that to it so I still can still use like central locking. Um, so yeah, I'm going to cut that off, weld this on and see what happens. Okay, I've lost it. Um, <laughs> it's got on the floor somewhere. Ah, there it is. Under there. I wonder how hot this is going to be. Oh, no, not hot at all. Right, there we go. So now my plan... Focus, there you go. Now my plan is... to... Prob I don't really know. I think I'm going to cut cut these tabs off here or cut a straight line down there and then weld that to it. You know what? I might try and find a wider spanner if I got one. Let's have a look. This is my odd spanner drawer. It's just got odd sizes. Oh, a 13. That's... Mm, no, that's not that great. Uh, one of these is like a spanner that I don't ever use. This 24, I definitely need this. No. Uh, right, I'll, I'll try, and find, try and find a spanner and then I'll get back to you. Right, so I found a 20 and I've got another two 20 so I can I can part ways with, with one. <laughs> um, the width, uh, where's that part of the key gone? Oh no. Ah, there it is, okay. Uh, the width is like exactly the same. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to cut them tabs off and then I'll start welding that and see what happens. <laughs> This is where we're at. It's the worst welding I think I've ever done, but I'll grind it down and you'll never know. <laughs> I think it's pretty cool. Uh, well, it'll be better once... Uh, I'm probably going to paint it up. Oh, that's a device. It's not very straight either, but... I think once it's cleaned up and like painted or something, I reckon that could be pretty cool. <laughs> Let's go test the welds in here. Oh yeah, that is mint. Right, let's try it in the door. Oh, sick. <laughs> Look at it, man. Right, let's try it in the ignition. Cool. Oh yeah, that 
Come on, you, don't, you can't say I don't look cool. That, <laughs> that looks pretty sick. Right, so yeah, this is just like a fun little video, just to see if I can make something. And I mean, it's not the prettiest at all, but I think once it's cleaned up and painted, that's going to look pretty cool, to be honest. I think I'm going to touch up on a couple spots of world and then grind it down, see what it looks like. But I'm I'm pretty happy with that, to be honest. That's pretty sick. <laughs> Right, so I ground, I ground down the welds a little bit, but it's not pretty. So, and I haven't, I've ran out of a flap disc, so I've only got, I've only got the cutting discs here. So um, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take it into work tomorrow and grind it down properly, and then paint it up at work. And uh, right now, I'm gonna drill a hole through there, or maybe here or something, so I can put a hoop on that, and then I can still have my central lock in as well. So. That'll be pretty cool. So that's gonna be it for this video then. Um I'm gonna I'll probably just like catch up with it in like a different video once I've got it all painted and got a hole drilled through it and stuff. But I'm gonna call it a night, but for now I think that's pretty pretty damn cool to be honest. Um I've got another video coming out this week, uh so subscribe if you wanna see it, you'll get the notification pop up. Um, that's going to be about installing the van, installing the engine in the van, not the van in the engine, putting the engine in the van, going to run it up, and then we also find some other problems with it. So if you want to watch that, subscribe, uh, you'll get the notification when I post it, and yeah, then you'll be able to watch it and be up to date with all my future videos. So yeah, just a bit of fun. Easy to do, it took me about 15 minutes. If you want to do something like that yourself and you've got a cheap welder, then I think it's a pretty cool thing to do. So, uh, you know, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, like and subscribe, and uh, see you later.